your father taught me. Okay, this way. My dad always wanted me to spend more time with my mom, but I doubt this is what he had in mind. Dear friends and new readers, I'm Nikki and this is my blog. Due to the recent death of my dad, I've been ripped away from my friends and thrown into this horrible situation that I have no control over. I'm currently 30,000 feet in the air due to land in the Czech Republic which I know nothing about and forced to live with Eve, the woman who gave birth to me, who I also know nothing about except for certain tidbits I see online. I'm going to miss all of you in the fun adventures we had together horseback riding, hiking, times at the beach, and much more than I could ever list. I'm certain I'll have many uneventful adventures which I'll share with you on my blog. Eve is a scientist, and Dad told me her dream since high school was to create something that would help the world. location in the Benisov district of the Czech Republic where for the past 60 years residents have been relying on hydroelectric power from the Cheb Dam. But now there's something new and exciting on the way. It goes by the name Helios. We're inside the Promethium Kinetics Lab with Dr. Eve Carter who is known for her developmental work in third world countries. The Helios project is a long way from a water reclamation system in Africa. What can you tell us about this new venture? Well, I've always been interested in alternate forms of clean energy. My team and I developed Helios, a special combination of gases gathered from just above the Earth's tectonic plate. That, when refined with hydrogen, allows them to be burned cleanly without any byproduct. All this takes place 200 feet below us in a network of highly powerful conversion turbines that we call medulas. Why the Czech Republic? Well, Europe has a lot of abandoned old coal mines, and we intend to recycle them. We've run our network of piping through existing coal mines channeled throughout the country. Coal? Oh, well, this is a new substance that burns 100% clean. It is pure energy mined from the planet. Sounds a bit like fracking, which has become a big problem in the United States. Well, um, this is a new procedure, completely different from fracking. We've been getting spectacular results. There are those who still say you're exporting a toxic American practice. Well, Promethean Kinetics, or PK, is not an American company. OK, but there is no public record as to who actually is funding the project. Well, what I can tell you is that everyone involved in the Helios project cares about one thing, and that is a cleaner, safer planet for us all. Thank you, Dr. Carter. Well, thank you very much. And up next, the U.S.-Russia debate continues over oil rights in the Ukraine. So who are you again? Henry. My wife and I own the house your mother lives in. This way. Oh, you and Eve got arrested on that Greenpeace ship in Antarctica, right? Uh, long time ago. Mm. So are you sleeping with Eve? What? No. I'm married, I told you. Her name's Olivia. You'll meet her soon enough. Got it.
As usual, Eve let me down again. You look older than your mother's pictures of you. My mother? I call her Eve. You know, she was disappointed not to be able to meet you here today. Let me guess, crazy work schedule, lost track of time, fire, flood, all the rest. Uh, the first one, I think. This is a new chapter in your life. Let go of the past and embrace the moment. Whatever. What did I expect from the woman who abandoned my dad and I 12 years ago? Now I'm stuck with her till I'm 18. We're almost there. Plus, there's a surprise at the house for you, which I know you'll love. That one. Looks like Zeus and Catherine like you. Great. An exciting new chapter in my blog, Nikki and the Chickens. I haven't seen anything or anyone for miles. You know, I wonder if Eve even remembers I'm a diabetic. I wish I could blame it on Eve comes from my dad's side of the family. The doctor said it was the diabetes that contributed to the heart attack that killed him. Uh, you sounded confident. Oh, with gosh. an element of caution. <laughs> All right, thank you, everyone. Get back to work. So, how's she doing? Not so good. What? You might want to look at this. Oh, my gosh. I am not comfortable going online Monday with these numbers. Neither do I. Declan has other ideas. Ugh, Declan, he always has other ideas. What's that? That's from me. Oh, Jacqueline, isn't it a little early to celebrate? A couple of days. Maybe more than that. What's he talking about? We're still doing tests. Well, as long as those tests show that we can go live. We'll see. Meanwhile, that is bad luck. I'll put it on ice. By the way, the consortium is very happy with the way you've been handling the press. Good. Don't you think it's time that the investors came out from behind the curtain? Soon enough. When? And the timing's right. The internet is getting conspiracy happy. Look, I understand your position, Eve. Look, the EU trusts us. And we can't have the press comparing us to a bunch of Texas frackers. Are you finished? Yes. Good. Because you have tests to run. OK. You might want to back off. Truth is, I really don't want to know where the money comes from. Laws and sausages. Sausages? As in, I don't need to know where they come from. Mm. Hey, can you take a look at something for me? Sure. Wait, I'm coming. Hey, today's the day, isn't it? Today? Uh, Nikki? Oh, yeah. Henry went to pick her up at the airport. You I... sent Henry? Yes, I sent Henry. I couldn't go, OK? I had that interview, and now we have this test this afternoon. The test is routine, Evie. I don't even really think I can relate to a 16-year-old. Well, think back. What did you do when you were 16? Yeah, I solved mathematical equations and I read chemistry journals. Exciting. <laughs> Party girl, huh? Go home and see her. <laughs> okay, yeah, I will. Okay, first we have to get this test done. Come on, Evie. Okay, come on, <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. I'll admit, I'm a little nervous to see her. What's there to do around here? 
There's a bus stop just up the road that you can take into the city. Good to know. Eve should be home in a few minutes. Welcome, Nikki. I'm Olivia. Hey. Come on in. Come on. I got the bag. Who to guessed? No sign of Eve. Well, at least I have Zeus and Catherine. Thanks. Stop fracking. Save the whales. <laughs> Nothing's changed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Would you like to see your room? Uh, yeah, sure. This way? Thanks. Yeah, here it is. Are you kidding me? Does she think I'm like five? I could show you around if you like. Might as well see the rest. Okay. Let me show that surprise for you out back. What's the problem now? This thing's broken down five times in five months. Ah, uh, relax. Killian's working on it. The only thing Killian's working on is trying to get into Eve's pants. <laughs> you finished over there? Uh, yeah. I just hope this thing stays together. Yeah, you and me, brother. Okay, let's see how strong she is. Killian, increase the flow to 10%. Pilot system opening. Meeting set pressure of 10%. Okay. Smooth. Take her up to 40. 20, 30, 40%. Whoa. That was one serious vibration. Yeah, I think it's in the heat exchange. What's the pressure in the medulla? 42.6%. It's still rising. Yeah, okay, let's back it off. Do you think it's the back pressure release valves? That's an easy fix, right? Maybe. But the medulla was saying we were at 42%. We shouldn't be getting that kind of reaction at this level. Right. All right, why don't you check them both, okay? We cannot launch until we get this right. Sure, I'll go down to the medulla and check it out. And you. Go home. Okay. Wait a second. We're scheduled to do a live test on Monday. How long is this going to take? We have to do another round of safety checks on the redundant systems. What, for a stuck valve? Every day we don't launch, we lose money. You know what, if something happens, this could be really serious, Declan, okay? Don't be a blind capitalist. This isn't your little science project. Maybe it was your technology, but that's been bought and paid for by the people that I represent. You understand? Yes, I understand. And everyone wants it done right, yes? They want it done now. And they want it done right. Which is why we're doing more tests, Declan. My neck is out there just like yours is. A sensor replacement is pretty simple. Then let's get ready to pounce and go live with Helios. No, we are not filling the lines with Helios now. We are sticking with the inert liquids until we are sure everything is working properly, and then we will go live with Helios. But you said it was an easy repair. I did not say it was easy. Let me be clear, Declan. Helios under pressure is like supercharged lighter fluid. The medulla is what regulates how much we pump into those old coal veins. Now, you don't want to risk flooding the valley with something akin to lighter fluid, do you? That's why we have control systems and a backup system. Which may not be working. Just let us do our job. Fine. You find out what the problem is and get it fixed. Killian is on it. Killian does what you tell him to. Because Killian knows I'm right. I don't mean to be difficult, OK? I have a lot of personal things going on. My daughter's just landed. I need to get home. Why don't we agree to disagree and just call it a day? Go see your daughter. 
Okay, we good? Go on, get out of here. Can we make this quick? I've got a date tonight. Copper, what's the reading over there? 8.2, higher than usual. I don't like that one bit. We're staying here till we figure it out. Goldman, recalibrate the system. It's Friday, let's go home. Soon enough. Hi, you reached my daddy, you leave a message. Hey Killian, it's me. I know you're probably still in the medulla, but I'm just a little worried. I don't know, I uh, hold on. Okay, I'm back. I, I just... <sighs> you know what? Never mind, okay? I, I've got to get home and forget about work. I am checking out for the weekend. I'll see you Monday. All right, bye. Stop worrying. Run the damn medulla now. Did Evie go home? Yes. Are we back online? Looks like it was a software issue. We're all good. Sensors, redundant system? Online. Good. Then I want to proceed forward with the live test using Helios. Come again. You heard what I said. Do we have a problem? Well, Evie and I discussed doing another round of tests before we go live. I can't be 100% sure software was the only issue. We'll delay another week. You want me to explain that to the consortium? Declan. I want the system filled. Am I clear? Am I clear? Or should I fire you and bring in a whole new team? Bring the Helios online. Roger that. Bring out the medulla controls. Prep for live test. Just going big and forgetting about the details could lead to trouble. We shouldn't be doing this. It's not ready. Increase the flow to full power and release the Helios. Surprise! Even Killian liked to ride them through the mountains. Hey, uh, try some feed. Maybe he'll take it from you the way he takes it from his mother. There That's you good go. Boy. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. Oh, don't. Yeah, not that good. <laughs> Your mother just started that. I didn't know she painted. Mm-hmm. Looks like him. <laughs> kind of. Took me about 50 tries. Hey. You look great. Me or the horse? Both. Uh, I was just showing Nikki around her new home. Oh, good. Did you like your bedroom? It's not exactly me. Well, you can redecorate it any way you like. That's nice of you. Um, did you eat? Uh, she was waiting for you. Me and Dad always ate together on Fridays. Well, today's Friday, isn't it? Yeah. Cool, let's go. Eat and rest. We'll drive to the city tomorrow. Okay. I'll clean up. You go talk to Nikki, I'll do it. No, it's fine. Where is she? 
In her room. <sighs> Has she been like this the whole time? Ever since you got home, she hasn't touched a meal. She's punishing me already. She's scared. Of what? Of you. Of me? That doesn't make any sense. Doesn't it? A strange woman shows up into her life and tries to blame mother? What is that supposed to mean? If you, me, and Henry made a lot of choices to be activists, mm -hmm. to make a difference, some of us chose not to have kids. <laughs> well, it wasn't really my choice. Yes, but you did choose her father to raise her. Now you have to earn her trust before you actually be her mother. Thanks for making me feel terrible. Again. You're welcome. Hey, guys. Check out this conspiracy video I found about PK and Eve's latest invention. It goes into detail. What the hell, Eve? Do you not know how to knock? I, uh, I just wanted to see what you were doing. Blogging. Oh, really? About what? How boring this place is. What do you want? I just wanted to... What? I want to tell you I'm really sorry about your father. Well, that was a year ago. I know, but we haven't seen each other since then. Well, I got your flowers. I wanted to come to the funeral, but work was just terrible. That's what you wanted. You know, I don't know what your father told you, but I really cared about him. Well, you've got a funny way of showing it. And by the way, this vegetarian thing that you're into, well, I'm not. So can we please have meat for our meal? I just thought because you were diabetic that... Meat, Eve. I need the protein. Got it. Eve, people are here to see you. I'll be right there. Oh, I'll just be a minute. Don't keep them waiting. <laughs> what, you guys can't even give me half a day? The fact that my cell phone was turned off should have been a hint. Sorry, but we need your help. For what? We gone live. With Helios. What the hell are you talking about? Killian. Do you have any idea what kind of risk you've just taken? Are you gonna help us or not? Help? <laughs> Apparently you didn't need my help when you made that stupid decision. We're getting some strange pressure fluctuations from the redundant systems. I need your eyes on it. She's never gonna forgive me. Who? Nikki. Just go. It's gonna be no Just more than- Just go. She doesn't want to see me, I don't want to see her, so forget it. I'm out of here.
I'm sorry you guys are locked up in here. I just came to say goodbye. bad feeling about this. Pressure has increased 49% in the release valve. I gotta check these numbers, Evie. Okay, I'm right behind you. What's happening? It's not good. Now at 52%. You still okay? It's rising faster than it should. The feed pump and the sensors seem normal, but we're pumping more Helios than we should. failure and number nine. Well, we need to take it offline. That pressure will knock out the entire system. This is a really bad idea, Declan. I made a call. Someone had to. Do you know what could happen if this thing goes south? Just a couple of bumps, that's all. It's working, which means we can go online to schedule. God damn it, Declan. You don't gamble with this kind of thing. Shut it down. Shutting down. Pressure spikes in the redundant system. It's just a valve settling like before. You know that for a fact, Declan? Check it. The system is down. There's no readout from the medulla. The entire system just went off grid. Loading backup systems. Donuts are down as well. That cannot happen. Everyone shut the hell up! Kappa, Goldman, Flint, Slater, suit up. We're going down to the medulla. We got a manual, we shut it down. We can't go down there, it's too dangerous. You heard me, let's move! Come on! Harvey, you, let's start thinking damage control right now. I think we have a problem. We're gonna be all right. This isn't safe at all. We'll be fine as long as it doesn't ignite. And what would really happen if it did? Guys, focus. We got less than a minute to turn this thing off. Check for any leaks. I got a bad feeling about this. There is a back full of Helios filling up this room. 20 seconds, guys. This is really bad. 15 seconds. Slater, hurry! There's leakage here. No, don't touch that! No! We have a Helios fire in the medulla. How much 
much Helios did it pump? A lot, and still flowing. It's gone into all the tunnels under the town. Congratulations. You just made Three Mile Island look quaint. What do we do? If those coal mines catch fire, the whole country will be destroyed. We'll be lucky if this entire area is uninhabitable for just 60 years. Is it another explosion? No. Worse. Eve, where are you going? You can't leave. Don't be crazy, I need you here. We have to fix this! You caused this. This is Red Protocol. Everyone leave the building. elevator door. Why aren't they opening the doors? Relax, it'll be fine. Evie, the medulla is no longer responding. Fire is not containable. I repeat, fire is not containable. We have to get out of here. Open the elevator doors. Eve's gone. What do you mean, gone? Call her back now. It doesn't matter. I've evacuated all personnel. Then let us in, Declan. Elevator doors are sealed. We'll regroup and figure something out. I can't do that. Declan, what the hell are you playing at? Open the elevator! I'm sorry, Killian. Declan, I have people down here. You have to let us in. Declan! We'll die down here. Why isn't he helping us? To cover his own ass. Uh, okay, guys. Uh, we gotta get out of these suits they covered in Helios. If we move fast, we can make it to the north exit shaft. Okay, let's go. I hope he figures out how to stop the Helios before it reaches Prague. And if she doesn't? Game over. Killian, please call me. The Helios is venting and exploding. How are we gonna stop this? Is this your fault? Do you realize the city is being evacuated? There's been some confusion. There is no confusion. This time, make sure it doesn't come back to us. We knew there'd be risks. And now I'm dealing with them. You're okay, Nikki. Are you all right? We're fine. We're fine. It was just like a good old California 6.5. You don't look so good. What happened? There was an accident at the plant. There's very likely that there's going to be another earthquake. We have the to get plant out of here. Cause this? Look, we don't need Damn to have a discussion, Eve, I warned Henry. you they would take your technology and they would pervert it. Stop it, your Henry. Company is responsible for this. Look, this is not the time for this kind of discussion. Well, when is the water? water? Flashlights, matches, Nikki. I want you to fill up this pet. Take that to the car. Okay, come on, come on, come on, let's go. Let's go, Nikki! Nikki, go. Go. Come on, let's go, let's go. Come on, quickly. We can't just let it all burn. I have to do something. Nikki, get in the car. The horses, I'm gonna take care of the horses. Nikki. Hey. Get the door open. Get you out of here. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take her out and hopefully he'll follow. Come on. Yeah, come on. Go! Come on, come on, 
Nikki. She's fine. Get in the car. What do you want? What are you going to do next? I'm taking Nikki to safety and then I'm coming back to clean up your mess. It's too late. The fire took it all. The medulla, everything. Killian? Gone. You son of a bitch. Why didn't you listen to me? I told you that it wasn't ready. Eve, I need to know what you're going to do. What do you mean, what am I going to do? I mean, what are you going to say? I am going to tell the truth, that you railroaded Killian into going online with Helios when it was not ready. It'll be your word against mine. At best, you'll be a co-defendant. Co-defendant? Is that where we're going now? You know what? I don't care! It's your choice. Let's go. Hey. You go. What? We're staying. No. You're crazy. It's all right. Go. You can't stay here. This is the only home Olivia and I have ever really owned. We're getting a little too old to play the vagabond lifestyle. We did that for years together. All right, we can do it again. No, if we stay, at least we got a chance at keeping it from burning down. We'll be fine here, Eve. No, you guys. Eve, let them go. Go. You've got Nikki. We've got this house. Are you sure? Yes, go. Listen to them. Go. <coughs> oh, thank God. We still got power down here. Are you insane bringing us down here? We are not miners. Please don't freak out, okay? I'm not freaking out. I'm just a little worried we might die. You saw what happened to Flint. What do you mean, die? There's got to be a way out, right? There is. We'll find it. So what now? Game over? All right, you guys, knock it off. Well, we got 12 hours to get out of here before the oxygen is gone. Now, we got to get to the emergency exit shaft and get the hell out of here. So far. Look, I can't promise you anything. But I can guarantee I'll do whatever it takes to get us out of here in one piece. All right? Huh? Copper? Yeah. Let's stick together. Move this way, come on. Come on! I'm sorry, but you can't blame them for trying to save their home. I grew up with them. I know! <gasps> so, do you like those horses? What? You know, the horses that Olivia and Henry had. Frau and Fraulein. I never liked those names. <laughs> Are you being serious? You know I taught your dad to ride? Oh. <gasps> you okay? They're gonna blame you for all of this. Well, sir, sounds like my boss Declan is. Well, maybe he's right to. <gasps> Do you really think that? I've seen you like twice in the past two years. I don't know anything about you. See if there's any news on that tablet of yours. You think it's true? What? That the CIA funded the Medulla knowing it would blow up? They need a reason to bring troops into the Ukraine so they can claim oil there. That's ridiculous. I don't know, man. I think we're lost. Just quit your whining, copper. Come on. A large spill of the controversial chemical Helios has occurred, causing massive subterranean fires. Can this be the cause of the earthquakes we're experiencing? At the 
extreme temperatures, Helios is said to burn. It could literally carve its own channels in the Earth, much like the fault lines which in turn trigger earthquakes. This image from NASA allows us to see in real time where the Helios is burning underground. You can see here it's moving towards Prague at a rapid rate. The spread of the Helios needs to be stopped within 12 hours or the city will be destroyed and thousands of lives will be lost. How long will it burn? There's no way of knowing. We've been trying to contact Dr. Eve Carter, who developed this chemical, but she's missing. However, we have Declan Glass to tell us what happened. My company trusted Dr. Carter. She not only betrayed that trust, but also the faith that the people of Europe placed in her. This is a very difficult time for me, as I've always considered Dr. Carter a close and personal friend. <sighs> Nikki, stay here, Nikki! <gasps> Nikki, stop! Don't do that! Let me out! All right. Nikki, stop it! What are you doing? Get back in the car! I'm done! Where are you going? Home! Stop! This is your home. Here! In the middle of your stupid science experiment! No, this was not me! My science was sound! You abandoned me and Dad for this! All of the... Oh, your mom's trying to save the world nonsense all the time before he died. He always admired you. Probably still loved you. Hey, Nikki, this look, is I'm bullshit. sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, How many even times try. do I have to say that? I hope they do blame you and you get what you really deserve. <gasps> ah! <sighs> Let's go to the car. Go to the car. Come on. Put on your seatbelt. Put it on. Oh. Oh my God. What was that? Oh my God. Oh my God. Get out of the car! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Henry, Olivia, what are you doing here? We could ask you the same question. Not really. I'm here to see Eve. She's gone. I came to help her. I bet you did. I'm sure with all your problems, you've got better places to be. What's with all the hostility? I came to help her sort out the mess she caused. Her mess? Yes. What did she tell you? About what? The accident. She said that if somebody came here saying it was all her fault, that it wasn't true. That's what I thought. About you. <gasps> Calm down. Where am I? Ma'am, you're in the evacuee camp. You're Luckily, not a doctor. No, ma'am, I'm not. Lucky for you, I found your car when I did. Where's my daughter? Let me guess. Nikki. Yes. She's fine. She was complaining about dizziness, but she's okay. Where is she? Take me to her. If you calm down, I will do that. Oh my god, I'm the worst mom in the world. Calm down, okay? I hope one day she can forgive me. Oh, my God. 
why don't you come over here and give us a hand, yeah? Yeah, but I, I wouldn't know what to do. Well, this isn't exactly our training either. Well, I'm glad you're here. We lost two trucks with all our medical supplies, and we're understaffed here. Well, okay, so what can I do? Look around you. These people are terrified. Just try talking to them. Captain, we need you. Excuse me. Nikki! Nikki! Are you all right? Oh, sweetie. Oh, thank God you're okay. Are you okay? Yeah, it's just that there's so many people. Yeah. So many. Who are those people? I think their son's missing. I wish I could do something to help. Maybe I should go talk to his parents. And say what? How sorry you are? Nikki, what do you want me to do? I am sorry. You know what? I need you to come and help me with my next patient. Come on. So, I figured we could use a new ride since you lost the car in the hole. Okay. You know how to repair motorbikes? Dad liked the idea of me being a hands-on engineer. He tried the same with me. <laughs> how did that go? Uh, not so great. I've always been more of a theoretical engineer. You know, he was a really smart guy too, Eve. I know. He was one of the smartest men I knew. It's one of the reasons I married him. What do you need? Uh, hand me the wrench. Are you all right? Where's your insulin kit? I'm fine. I just need some something to eat or... No, but where is your kit? I don't know. That is not good. Well, you shouldn't have crashed the car. I didn't crash. Look, just sit down. Stay here. I'm going to get something. <sighs> we must be getting close. It's awfully tight in here, man. Okay, oh. okay, 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 okay. Come on, keep it cool. Oh. It's, a, it's a bit wider here. I hope Diane and her parents are safe. I'm sure they're all fine. How bad do you think it is up there? I don't know, okay? Just let's keep moving. Let's try here, come on. Yeah, this looks like the right way. Killian. Killian, it's me. I always used to come to you for answers, and now... We've got about five hours until the Helios reaches Prague. Excuse me, excuse me, I Dr. just need Carter, to... Dr. Carter, what the hell do you think excuse you're doing? Me. I just need to see a map. <sighs> okay, so we're here, and the dam is here. And if we open the spillway, the flood... This whole valley's gonna be flooded. Doctor, I need to speak to your commanding officer. Nikki. What? Follow me. Is she okay? What's going on? Nikki. Nikki, Nikki, it's me. It's me. Dad? She's a diabetic, huh? Yeah, we lost her insulin kit. 
I've been giving her fruit juice to tide her over, but it's not working. Captain, when you found us in the car, did you find an insulin kit at all? No, no insulin kit. It's not here. She needs juice. Yeah, this is Captain Hill. I need something sweet in the med tent ASAP. Let me stay with me. Stay with me. You know what? Fruit juice isn't even going to be enough. She needs insulin. Look, with all the evacuees, we're running out of everything. This is the other sir. This is it. This is all we have in the camp. Yeah, this is all. Negative, Corporal. We need to focus on the injured. Let's let the local authorities deal with the looters. Where are we going to get the insulin? Look, there's a town nearby, OK? We're going to check and see if they have a pharmacy. Can you send somebody? No can do. We're waiting on another team in the morning. The morning? The morning is too late. She needs insulin now. Doctor. I'm going to go. Uh, uh, how are you going to get there? You should take the motorcycle. OK. Yeah, yeah. You know, I got a son about Nikki's age. Is that right? What's his name? Tom. Look, I got to be honest with you. I don't like this plan one bit. Well, I have another plan. Figured out how to stop the fires. Flood the valley with water from the dam. Yeah, and the Czech government. They're going to give you the green light for this. Look, the Helios will burn for 100 years unless we stop whoa, it. Whoa, 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 Doc. This is way above my pay grade. Look, if you want my advice, right now, you need to take care of your daughter. I am. Your face is all over the news. You know, the accident at the plant. What do they say? Look, take this and be careful. Oh, I hate guns. Look, there's a lot of people that want to hang this on you, OK? I can be court-martialed for this. I need you guys' word you'll be back in an hour. I promise. Thank you, Captain. Call me Derek. Good luck, guys. You're going to need it. Can I help you? Oh, Captain, yes. I'm looking for a woman and her daughter. I believe they were here earlier. The Americans? Yes, yes. Can you tell me where they are? Well, I can tell you they left base. You think anyone's looking for us? If Declan has his way, we'll never be found. Are you getting anything on that? Not a chance. We're still too late. That guy's crazy. I heard he ran interrogation rooms in Nam. Wait a second. What, what, what's the matter? It's just, this intersection shouldn't be here. Oh, we've been walking for hours. Don't, Don't tell me that we're lost, man. Just give me a minute. I know. I'm trying to find you one, okay? Just stay with me. Why? I just need you to, okay? All right, come on, let's go.
Mom, I really don't feel so good. Okay, we're gonna find some insulin for you. How come you lost the kid in the first place? I didn't lose it. Nothing's ever your fault. It's your medicine. Don't you learn how to take care of yourself? What? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, come on. We're gonna find a pharmacy, come on. Let's go. Okay. Quick. You think it'll be okay there? No, that's all we got right now. Come on, let's go in here. I need a pharmacy. Get in. I don't feel so good. to me. Have it all worked out. Who's that? I just want to help you. What's going on? Okay. We got to get out of here. Take that with you and come with me. Get down. <coughs> come on, come on. We're running out of time and oxygen. It's getting hotter down here. The fire must be spreading. We're in the frying pan. Yeah, out of the pan and into the fire. What do you mean by that? Relax, we'll be fine. No, 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 what do you mean by that? I'm just worried that when we get to outside, we're gonna have other issues. Declan tried to kill us. Never listen, money can make people do bad things. Yeah, what's to stop him finishing what he started? The truth, the truth will stop him. <sighs> Maybe we should just keep our mouths shut. Hey, I want y'all to hear this. When we get out of here, we all tell the truth of what happened and what Declan did, okay? You think lying's gonna help you? Think again. The best way to keep a secret is to bury everyone who knows it, and they already tried that. All right? Okay. Okay? Got it. With you all the way. Good. We stay on track, we'll be out of here in no time. Come on.
The choke. Where? The choke. Where? There. Get out the way. Get out the way. Hey, you can't drive that. Well, neither can you, clearly, so get in. Oh. Look like the access stairs. We must be getting closer to the surface. Killian, try the radio. Maybe it'll work. Evie. Evie, do you copy? Eve, testing one, two, three. Eve, come in. Eve, what are you doing? Killian? Evie? Do you copy? Killian, thank God, you're alive. Yeah, we're okay. Yeah, we're in the old access section of the mine trying to find a way out. It's the only place I got signal. Where are you? I'm on my way to the dam. I know how to stop it. The fires? Firequake. Is that what we're calling it? It's the dam. We can drain the entire thing and put out the fires. You've got to get out of there before I release the water. You'll flood the entire valley and wipe out the town. No, listen. The main vein of the old coal mine runs just east of the spillway under the river, right? About 3,000 meters below the spillway. Yeah, but it's being superheated by the Helios fires. Yeah? Yeah, and a big burst of water is going to break through the riverbed, and it'll flood the mines. It'll put out the fires and neutralize the Helios. It's a lot of ifs, Evie. If it doesn't break through, it'll hit the village like a tidal wave. Yeah, well, you got a better idea? No. OK, neither do I. Listen to me, Evie. Stay away from Declan. Yeah, he tried to seal us in the mine and kill us. Tell her to get us out of here. He just tried to shoot me. Stay away from him, you understand me? Yeah. And you be safe, OK? And get out of that mine as fast as you can. Out. And wish me luck. The dam. Okay, you guys. Listen, at least we've made contact. Yeah. Let's keep heading on. Come on. So you're gonna drain a dam? Yeah. Mickey, what? Next time, keep me in the loop, Mom. Mom, kind of like that. Yeah, well, don't get too used to it, Eve. Let's go. Hey, this is the access to the old mine, back into the shaft. Come on, guys, we can get through here. Come on. Come on, movie, take it easy now. We're in the middle of hell. Oh my God. It's gonna get light in half an hour. We'll get some gas. And we'll keep going straight down that road and we'll get to the dam. If you're sure. Okay, stop, stop, stop. There's no power, no gas. It's okay. What do you want? Just some food, gas. Okay, Get something to eat. You know how to fix those gas pumps? I have no idea. 
There's the fuse box I was on check. Did you learn that from your dad? Yep. Promethium Kinetics, the company that has been implicated in the disaster, has just issued a statement. While Promethium Kinetics deeply regrets the loss of life, we cannot excuse the actions of Dr. Eve Carter. Evidence has been discovered. Don't move! No, look. You don't understand. You caused this. Look, we'll just go. Five million euros for the capture. I've got five million reasons. Why not? Mom, you really gotta go now. You're not going anywhere. Down. Come on. They're asking five million for me, so you know I gotta be dangerous. Put it down. Put it down! We heard gunfire. What are you doing? Stealing a police car. Mother of the year. It was Eve Carter. She escaped out the back. What's that sound? Forget about the sound. The heat. I can hardly breathe. that. Stay back. Oh my god. It's causing more damage than we thought. We have to turn around. No, we can't. We're running out of time. We have to jump over. There's no other way. We can make it. I don't know about this whole disaster thing, but this will definitely land you in jail. You think? <laughs> yeah, I think. I had her. She ran away when you two pulled up. Dr. Eve Carter? Yeah, it was her. I recognized her from the TV. Can I help you, sir? No. Just a concerned citizen. <sighs> okay. We can jump. <laughs> what? Well, it can't be more than eight feet. We can do this. You're sure about that? Yeah. <laughs> okay. 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 <sighs> oh. <sighs> nice. <laughs> Not bad for an old man, huh? Okay. Come on, let's take this one at a time. Okay. Go, man. Come on. Come on. This is Unit 16. We're heading to the north side of the mountain to investigate the fireway to see if there's any survivors over. Who'd have thought? Dr. Eve Carter. Scientist. Activist. <laughs> Mom of the year. all over the news, Declan. You need to fix this immediately. I'm working on it. Don't worry. Come on, you can do this. Do you know what class are always flunked? Fizz Ed. Yeah, well, you know what? The old man just made it, so come on, let's yeah, go. he did it, you can do it. 
You go first. Slater. See you on the other side, huh? Hold your hand. Knock it off. I can do this. Come on. You can do it. Get out of here. I'm sorry. Okay? We're all sorry. But we gotta get out of here. You understand? Come on. I think just a few kilometers. Do you see anybody? Like, you know, anybody following us? Uh, no, but it looks like there's a helicopter. And that seems to be following us. We have to get to the dam. We've just spotted Dr. Eve Carter and her daughter driving a stolen police car. Dr. Carter is being blamed for the explosions at the PK Industries plant, which resulted in the fire quakes occurring around the country. Calling us live is Declan Glass, CEO of PK Industries. Declan, can you tell us what's going on? Eve Carter is clearly a very dangerous lady. She is the sole cause of this disaster, and I'm making it my responsibility to stop her from any dangerous stunts she's trying to pull. I gotta hurry. Nikki, you stay here. I want you safe when the police come. No way. I want to go with you. We're a team. Okay. Let's go. Watch out! I saw four spillways when I came in. And this is pump room number one. Ah! Here, here! Come on! It's showtime, boys. Get those weapons out. You heard it. Let's move. Go, go, go! Come on, move it! Check! Soldiers are entering the dam to capture Dr. Eve Carter. Meanwhile, forest fires ravage the countryside as the Helios from the PK disaster continues to burn and threatens the city of Prague. U.S. President Barack Obama continues to send more troops to aid the Czech people as the disaster grows with no solution in sight. Come on, come on!
What? You know how to shoot that thing? Your father shot me. Yeah. Shots fired! I repeat, shots fired! Okay, this way! I think the control room must be up there. Okay, let's go. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you sure? I'm fine. Go. Okay, go. we're almost there. We're almost yeah. there. I'm coming. Come on, honey. Okay. Slater, you go first, then Kappa. I'll follow. No. I no, not this time, Killian. I'm claustrophobic, man. I can't do it. We only ought to, gotta get through this. No. Wait a minute. I see sunlight up there in the shaft. After this, we can get out. I need you to drain the reservoir. You want us to do what? Just empty the dam. We've been trying to prevent this. Your earthquakes are... Yes, they're being caused by underground fires which have to be extinguished now. How did you get here? Yeah, let's just do it! You're gonna flood the whole valley. Not exactly. If I release the water from the dam, it will flow downstream, go through the ground, and then it will put out the fires in the mine. We gotta do this now. Lady, you're crazy. So, what do I do? Lady, please. <sighs> Open the main valve, activate the power actuator, pull that lever. Okay. You! Open the main valve. Go! Go! You won't shoot me. There'll be hearings. <laughs> a lunatic with a gun will not make a credible witness. Yeah, but it won't just be me. There are others like Killian. Dead. You so sure about that? I swear to God, I'll shoot her in the head, Eve. Help team, I need you at our location now. If I can get through, you can get through. Don't you dare! I will shoot her! Don't you dare! Do She's it. dead! Get her. You get off her! Get up! What are you waiting for, Captain? Put the gun down now, Dr. Carter! Don't believe him! Just listen to me! Shoot Please her! Leave her alone. She's trying to help!
get you out of here, Doc. Take her away. I'm going with her. I love you. This is a block of truth. The woman who gave birth to me, I never really knew her. She left when I was very young. Over the years, I came up with all sorts of reasons to hate her, and I let those reasons define her. They wanted to give her 20 years. I thought I might never get the chance to really know her. Let's wrap it up and move on, boys. Two of the techs survived the firequake and told everyone the truth about what really happened. Though thousands of people died, Eve's quick thinking saved millions more. She was held a hero in the Czech Republic. Declan Seth didn't put an end to the investigations. We may never know why he did what he did. The country's moving on and rebuilding, just like Eve and I. Welcome to Mickey and Eve's Healthy Choice. Is it two for dinner? Come follow me. Right here, how's this? Eve was offered a choice of high-profile jobs. I was offered a ticket back to California. But instead, we chose each other. We faced a lot together in those first months. But the truth is, we caught up on a lifetime. So, have you decided? Well, chicken is an option, but the vegetarian casserole is my favorite. Mom? But, <laughs> chicken it is. <laughs> Now we have a family just like Dad wanted. I've learned to let go of the past and accept her for who she is. She is my hero. She's my mom. Dad, wherever you are, I can feel you watching over us. And we love you. <laughs> 